Hello guys, welcome back to our channel. Hope you all are doing good. And today in this video, we're gonna talk about how to complete digital profile 100% by completing 6 steps. And what are those 6 steps? And also, uh, one more question that is it mandatory to complete this digital profile? So, before answering all these questions, if you are new to this channel, and haven't subscribed to our channel yet then do subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so that you will get the notification whenever we upload a new video and also guys uh, you can observe from this picture that most of the viewers are from non subscribers only means you are watching the content but not subscribing to our channel please do subscribe to our channel it uh, will be motivation for us to uh, do more useful content please do subscribe to our channel So coming back to our video, uh, as I said in the previous video that uh, there is an update on digital profile. TCS have converted digital profile to digital profile 2.0 by enhancing some new features. And in the last video I have explained what all the new features were added in this digital profile 2.0. Uh, if you still haven't watched that video, please go and watch that video. Uh, and I'll, I'll also give you the link in description, please check it out. So, uh, as it updated, uh, respective RMGs are sending mails to their employees uh, to update their digital profile 2.0. You can see this mail. Uh, this is the mail I got from my RMG. You can check your TCS, TCS mail. You might also got the same mail from your uh, RMG or the RMG communications. Uh, uh, you can see this uh, digital profile 2.0 is your digital avatar and it is all about you. And you can also see here that uh, same which I have told you in the last video that your digital profile unlocks the opportunities personalized for you based on your skills and experience or the interest you have mentioned in your digital resume. So with that uh, digital profile uh, you can get notified for your new next project and uh, what are the trainings you need to get uh, enrolled and um, you can also uh, connect the mentors to guide you in your career. So this will all, all happens with your uh, digital profile which is completed 100% and uh, you can also see here that they are saying that to suggest the best matching opportunities keep your profile correct and complete. It should be 100% then only it will suggest you the best, best uh, matching opportunities means uh, in uh, coming projects it will suggest you the best matching uh, projects. And uh, the next one is uh, start with the simple connect to LinkedIn. With two clicks, you can bring your LinkedIn profile to Digital Profile 2.0. It means, as I said in the last video, that uh, they have bring some enhancements, right? In that, the uh, uh, bringing your LinkedIn profile into Digital Profile 2.0 is one of the most interesting and uh, uh, topmost uh, uh, enhancement and the new feature which were uh, which was added in this uh, Digital Profile 2.0. So that you can uh, bring your LinkedIn profile into Digital Profile 2.0. It will be helpful for you uh, for to get the very relevant and personalized project for you. So as I mentioned in the last video, uh, to complete our Digital Profile 100%, we need to complete 6 steps which were given in the Digital Profile page. And uh, as I promised in the last video, I will tell you how to complete uh, your digital profile 100% by completing those 6 steps. And uh, uh, first of all, to get into this digital profile 2.0 page, uh, you need to have a path, right? Uh, the path has not changed. It was same as uh, uh, digital profile only. But I am repeating the path again to the people uh, who don't know the path for digital profile. Uh, and the path is uh, go to ultimatics and then employee services in that employee self services and under employee self services there will be digital profile 2.0 otherwise you can also search for uh, digital profile uh, 2.0 in the uh, search bar in your ultimatics so whenever you enter into digital profile 2.0 page uh, you will see the page like this. Uh, here on the top right corner, you can see the percentage of, uh, not on the corner, uh, somewhat uh, below only. You can see the percentage of your uh, digital profile, uh, which how much percentage it is completed. And you can see that uh, how many steps you have completed there out of six there. Uh, 
some of the steps will be auto completed some of the steps you need to complete so i will tell you what are the steps and what are you need to complete and what will be automatically completed so once you uh, complete all those six steps this uh, uh, this profile will be like 100% and uh, uh, this message will be displayed there all set you are complaint now so you can see here mine was uh, already completed i have completed my digital profile 2.0 100% so uh, that is why it is showing like 100% so to complete this uh, first you have to click on the six steps uh, whatever it will be uh, it, uh, in your case it will be like uh, 2 out of 6 or 4 out of 6 any, anything it might be you click on that then it will be like this you can see all the 6 steps open here what are the 6 steps and what you need to complete what all uh, already completed the completed one will be uh, marked with green color here uh, you can see that uh, these are the 6 and the let's see one by one and the first one is uh, about me and the second one is other role and the third one is role fourth one is TCS experience and the next one is engagement and the last one is achievements so you need to give all these six informations uh, then your profile is said to be done so now uh, I will tell you how to complete these uh, one by one first uh, when you want to give uh, about me then uh, on the left side you can see about me and uh, there is a pen symbol to edit that edit symbol is there if you click on that uh, edit option will be enabled like this and uh, here you need to write a description that highlights your skills and expertise you can give anything that uh, you can uh, give a brief introduction about yourself not self introduction but uh, you have to describe yourself uh, in the same way how you uh, describe yourself in your uh, personal resume you can give here also and uh, click on save then uh, your about me will be uh, marked as green and next uh, uh, you have to complete the next step second step is other role other role is uh, nothing but uh, beside your uh, primary role like uh, your primary role will be there right uh, engineer developer or any uh, support associate anything will be there right beside your uh, primary role there will be other role like uh, uh, if you are a team member uh, you are a team member a give you can give team member if you are a team lead you can give that uh, manager uh, those are the uh, secondary roles other role you can give that in other role so uh, that you need to give here i am a team member so that i can i have given here uh, i am a team member in the other role you can give according to your role so to complete that other role you can uh, scroll down a little if you scroll down a little you can see here that uh, other role option is there if you click on that yes you can uh, give here uh, uh, whatever the role you have if you are a team member you can give team member if you are a team lead you can give team lead anything you have uh, anything which you are uh, you can give there and uh, then after that if you come back uh, the other role is said to be uh, and it, it will be marked as green it has to be completed then uh, the third one is role coming to role uh, you no need to do anything here uh, role will be tagged by your supervisor so if the role is not tagged yet then uh, talk to your supervisor and get it tagged as early as possible so that it will be marked as uh, green the role should be tagged to complete your uh, digital profile 100 percent so talk to your supervisor about this and uh, coming to the fourth one tcs experience you can uh, give your uh, experience inside TCS and outside TCS also. Uh, sometimes it will be taken automatically. If it is not taking automatically, then you can uh, give your uh, experience. If you are a fresher, then uh, you have to give your swan and uh, you have to give the uh, I mean uh, duration from when to when you have worked for that particular project. If you don't know uh, your swan or uh, duration which you have worked for particular project, then you can check in your uh, uh, allocation and utilization page. I have also made a video on that uh, how to check your project details. If you uh, haven't watched that video, I'll give you the link in description. You can go and watch that video and uh, get the details of your uh, experience. So in the left side uh, under uh, work experience section, you can uh, update your experience. If it is not taken automatically, then you can uh, enter it manually. 
then this will also get marked as green after completion of your experience i mean after entering your experience there and uh, coming to last two uh, that uh, that is nothing but engagement and achievements uh, you have to complete these two also to complete your digital profile 2.0 100% so if you scroll a little like uh, you can come back to other role uh, edit option there right you can come back to there uh, there you can see engagements and achievements you can uh, give your engagement and achievements uh, to be frank i don't know what to give in the under uh, engagement so that i have given uh, na there if you don't know anything uh, i mean uh, what to fill if you don't know what to fill in any field then you can simply give na and then uh, in achievements you can give anything uh, that you have achieved inside tcs or outside tcs you can give anything any of your achievements if nothing is there you can simply put na but have to put na even uh, if you don't have anything you have to put uh, at least na don't leave it empty if you leave it empty it should be uh, it will be like uh, you have not completed that uh, uh, i mean that step then uh, your profile will not be completed so please uh, put na or anything related to that if you have if you don't have you can put uh, na there is no problem then save all those and come back you can see here if you complete all those six steps then it will be like 100% you can see in my case it is 100% i have completed all these uh, uh, as you said that uh, i have given uh, in, uh, na in engagements and achievements so uh, like that way you can also give in any field which you don't know what to fill in that you can give na so this is how you can complete your digital profile 100% uh as i said rmg is started sending the mails to their employees is it uh, it is mandatory to complete the uh, digital profile 100% because if you don't complete this digital profile 100% then you will not be a compliant in adc so you have to complete your digital profile 100% uh, it is mandatory so this is the video guys uh, hope i have given you the uh, useful information only if you feel the video useful for you then please like the video and uh, subscribe to our channel for more information